Well, thank you for being here, Georgi Gigashvili. <laughs> it's a great pleasure to welcome you to the Classic uh, headquarters, the Classic uh, concert space here in Aubonne in Switzerland, yeah. the morning of your concert uh, this evening here yeah. at for Classic. And congratulations on being part of the Classic Ambassador Program for 22-23. Um, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's, it's built for young artists such as yourself. And um, we hope that through promotion and through connecting you to, to important industry leaders, the program can really help yeah. uh, transition you from study to a professional career. So congratulations on joining us this morning. And I'll jump straight in and say congratulations very much on your recent success at the Rubenstein competition in <laughs> Tel Aviv. Thank you, thank you so much. You've come fresh from Tel Aviv and the concerts post-competition yes. performance where you won second prize. Yes. And important to my heart, the Chamber Music Prize yes. and Audience Prize. Yes. These are huge. Um, <laughs> symbols of connecting with audiences immediately. And, and that's the most important one. I think <laughs> so too. Um, so this is, this is, this is superb. I, I was able to watch some of your performances at the Rubenstein via <laughs> the internet. And uh, particularly I enjoyed your chamber trio performance because you were really enjoying yourself, yes. it was clear. And you were connecting with the, with the other artists. How did you manage to still be smiling <laughs> through such yeah. an intense competition and yeah. competition experience? Um, so first of all, thank you so much. Uh, it means a lot that I'm here. And uh, because for every young uh, artist, uh, it mean, means a lot to have this kind of back um, and uh, being helped by this kind of people and uh, organizations. Um, because it means a lot to um, be prepared for the world, uh, a mu music wor world, which is sometimes cruel, but here uh, not any hint of cru cruel cruelty. So it's wonderful here, and I'm really, uh, I really hope that uh, audience can enjoy my play playing, hopefully. Uh, and um, yeah, uh, Rubinstein was yes uh, all, always in my heart uh, from the age of uh, eight, may, maybe, uh, because in Georgia we we have this uh, tradition watching this uh, uh, competition when this uh, Alexander Cor Corsantia won um, uh, in 1995 or seven, uh, I'm n n n not sure. But since then, it's a uh, really tradition to follow the co co competition from the first round to the finals. So yeah, um, it was my dream came true uh, and I couldn't have imagined that uh, I would have been in the finals <laughs> and the second prize, it means a lot. But most, uh, the most important thing is that uh, I've got the audience prize, uh, ju junior jury prize, um, and the chamber mu mu music prize. And uh, I was smiling on the outside, <laughs> but inside I, uh, uh, I, uh, I was totally exhausted and uh, dead inside. <laughs> but yes, um, I never think of the competition like it's the competition and uh, I have to uh, beat someone. Um, it's always a recital or the concert feeling and I think everyone should be like this uh, because uh, we are we are not competing uh, um, uh, each other. Uh, it's like we have uh, our independent uh, path. So uh, everyone can uh, uh, enjoy and see what ju jury thinks, but uh, it's not uh, necessary to think about what ju jury thinks uh, because we have to contribute uh, what we have inside and play what we are. 
So uh, I, 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 I was trying uh, to do that completely. Um, and I think uh, I managed it very well. <laughs> I, I think I, I would say that you succeeded. Yes. Uh, <laughs> Because I think you're absolutely right. Uh, the best um, competitions are there to, to discover and to the best competitions are, are really a series yes. of concerts. It's yes, like a festival course. in a way. Yeah. And if you're able to be yourself throughout and connect yeah. authentically, um, it, it, it shows a professional future. It shows a performing career. Yes, yes. And um, yes. congratulations. Thank you so much. So you must be a good uh, performer in that case <laughs> if you can still smile um, yes. through, <laughs> through the process. <laughs> you mentioned Georgia and you mentioned uh, following the Rubenstein as a sort of, as a country obsession. Yes. And I know from my own experience in having visited Tbilisi uh, a number of years ago that Piano is very important. Yes, it and is. you have your own piano competition that's yes, very well yes. regarded. Yes, uh, well, uh, I was there uh, in two thousand seventeen, and I won. <laughs> so voila! Yeah, <laughs> yeah good, it was good preparation. Like the beginning of my career, bec uh, because uh, I was sixteen. And wow. uh, yes, the age uh, limit started from 16 to 32. Correct. And uh, yeah, uh, it was my first chance. So yeah, it was, yeah, yeah. C congratulations. <laughs> Thanks. Um, <laughs> and you, you, you come from Georgia with what I would call a great interest in music in general, but you yeah. didn't start in a way being no. <laughs> definitely sure that that classical piano was going to be your yes. um, outlet or your, uh, I guess, um, uh, you know, uh, public path. Yes. You had a broad musical interest. <laughs> uh, and I'd like to hear a little bit about that, okay. but we'll come to that a bit later. But yes. when and how did you come to the piano or, or, or did the realization that this instrument and this this repertoire is going to be your yeah uh, I think take uh, up a lot of your time yeah yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I think the answer is uh, very simple because uh, my mother was a, a pianist and she always wanted to me to play the pia pia piano uh, and from the age of uh, four uh, I started to play, but it's not playing, of course. Um, but then, uh, at the age of 10 or 11, it was local competition in Tbilisi, a uh, small co co competition. And uh, I, uh, I was, um, uh, uh, it, it was my first co co competition. And uh, I've had the first prize and the best uh, interpreter of uh, Mozart. So yeah, uh, after this, uh, I had uh, um, my brain opened <laughs> and uh, I decided that uh, I want to play all my life. So that, uh, that was the key moment uh, in my la life. But um, yeah, uh, I, uh, I was also singing and uh, yeah, it was hard to, to pre practice for four and five uh, hours because I had uh, lots of hobbies to do. Yeah. Uh, I was also painting, I, uh, I, uh, I was singing. Uh, I wouldn't uh, always, uh, I, I really wanted to uh, have fun with my friends. Yeah, and that's the problem in Georgia because everyone wants to uh, have fun yeah. and uh, <laughs> everyone wants and to outdoors. party. Yes. yes. Away so, from the piano. Yes. Uh, but uh, I uh, again managed <laughs> to uh, practice and uh, yeah, well, I'm he here now. So uh, I think it was a good choice. I, yes. I think I, I'd like to touch because touch on a point that you mentioned, you actually have a broad interest in music, full yes. stop. And I think that is very important to a well-rounded artist. Yes. Uh, <laughs> a a well-rounded classical pianist. I think it's healthy to have, to be curious yes. and to, to have a range of interests. And I'm gonna dig a little bit deeper <laughs> because I understood and have discovered and have listened to 
some of your singing and vocal performances. Stop, please. And <laughs> arrangements that you did at the age of 14 when you yeah. entered the Georgian version of The Voice. Yes, yes, yes. And your capacity for enjoying music, <laughs> popular music, just shines through. Yeah. I mean, it, it's clear that it was very important to you, that, oh that, God, that yes. music of, of almost any genre is really important to you, yeah. or speaks to you. Yes, yes. Uh, what, uh, what can I say? Uh, I, I think I'm not a good singer, uh, in my uh, opinion. <laughs> um, but uh, I think it's um, important uh, because it has a very good connection with the classical mu 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 music, with the singing, yes. with the... Uh, also, uh, I, I would say, for example, for today's program, uh, I have uh, mostly romantic um, yeah, co co composers, and uh, it's very... Um, it's the key that um, I know how to uh, do the phrase because I can sing that yes. fra fra phrase. So it helped me a lot, and uh, also the playing the pi piano helped me to sing mm -hmm. uh, because uh, I could make my uh, arrangements and uh, I uh, I could play and all also together sing, and um, yeah, uh, it was really helpful for for me and. Um, it's, it's a part of me, really. <laughs> I also think it's a real confidence uh, builder yes, from a yes. young age for pianists who are particularly focused with the instrument and you have your own relationship yes. with this, to be able to sing and to be able to... Yeah, to and uh, what's to more, uh, I have no fear being on the stage. Exactly. So it's, it's really good. Okay, it's really well, good. <laughs> I recommend our viewers, if you have time, to, 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 to research Georgi Gigashvili on SoundCloud and you'll hear some, some, <laughs> some amazing young arrangements. Please, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'd, like to, I'd like to turn to um, your ambassador. Yes. Uh, this is the Classic Ambassador Program, uh, which is uh, essentially um, young artists are nominated by a range of ambassadors. Yes. And your ambassador is Sonia Simonauer, who nominated you for this, <laughs> for this, uh, for this program. And I'd like to, to explore a little bit about how you came to meet one another, yeah. how you found one another. Um, yes, uh, it was post-COVID uh, uh, era <laughs> uh, in 2021. Uh, in uh, October, uh, I was participating in Bad Kissingen, a uh, Klavier Olymp co competition. It's a very, very, very good co competition mm -hmm. uh, because it's a one uh, uh, ra ra round uh, recital and we can play whatever we want. So, and uh, in the ju jury, uh, there, there, there were so many uh, not so many, but three p p p people, but so like a amazing mu musicians, and one of them was uh, Sonia, and Wonderful. then uh, yeah, I've got the first prize and also the audience prize, which is um, which is harder in Germany than in Te Tel Aviv or in jo Georgia, because uh, in Germany. Uh, there are lots of mu mu musicians and uh, they admire like classical uh, yes yes i uh, understand yes yes so um but uh, i was so happy and about sonia which uh, which and who i love uh, like uh, a mother figure <laughs> yes uh, and uh, after this uh, competition she became my uh, manager which is fantastic. Very good. A good and manager uh, to have. Yes. Very good manager to find. So, um, and uh, she's uh, uh, so, so, so kind. Mm. And she uh, lets me to be me, which is, which is so rare in the management, uh, <laughs> yes, um, world. Um, and uh, uh, 
she she likes me a lot, lot as a human being, which is more important to, for me uh, because we have to have this kind of bond bonding, and we had it so easily. And uh, yeah, we are friends of uh, of course, uh, and I am her admirer, uh, and um, yeah, we have this kind of connection uh, which helps me a lot. Mm. I, think, I think that's ideal because I think our role, uh, particularly here at Classique, similarly yeah. to Sonia, well Sonia's part of Classique, yes. it's, it's to mentor, it's to tailor advice yes. to each individual artist because exactly. the journey of every artist is different. Yes. And you have to be you, and we are here to support you to be the best version yes. of you that you can exactly. be. Exactly. Um, well, a great <laughs> outcome for this competition, for entering this competition, to, 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 meet, yes. to meet helpful mentors. <laughs> yeah. Another mentor or hero or... Um, Please say her. Please <laughs> say her. <laughs> a person that is important to you, pianist, uh, <laughs> genius, artist, you know, Exempl uh, exemplary performer is Marta Agrish. Yes. And uh, I'm wondering, or I can't help but not think that you came to Geneva to continue your studies yes. in a way as pilgrimage to follow <laughs> the influence yes, of yes. Marta. So the story begins uh, when I won the first prize in Spain in Vigo International yes. co co Competition. And um, she was in the Jew, Jew jury, was a jury pres president, and she gave, gave me, handed me this uh, diploma. Uh, yes, the first prize. Um, and uh, she was always my uh, I uh, idol, mm -hmm. my my first uh, idol. When I when I when I was twelve, uh, I listened to her performance of Prokofiev Third Co Concerto and then I started to memorize it yes and then I started to play it and uh, it's the most played Co Co Concerto by by me because I feel at home and uh, it's partly because of her because she feels at home mm. uh, and um, it's very imaginative and uh, yeah it's totally me and uh, yeah uh, I won the perform that at, yes, the, at the Vigo yes yes oh, uh, fantastic. and um, in the Rubinstein co competition in the finals yes. I, uh, I played this co concerto at the Busoni co competition yes. uh, I played that in Tbilisi co competition uh, I played that so it grows on me it gr grew on me so um, yeah, I thank her that um, she she she's there wherever she is now. <laughs> but um, uh, I feel uh, her um, that he she she she's there and she's gi 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 given me so much power. Uh, yeah, um, and uh, yeah, I admire her so 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 much. <laughs> Because you, you were uh, studying here in Geneva at the Haute yes. de Musique. Yes, with uh, Nelson Gurner, exactly. uh, another protege uh, of Marta. Yeah. And um, yes, uh, uh, it was her uh, cho choice and um, um, she mm, told me in 2021 in Cicinandali Festival, uh, which is in uh, Georgia, and it was uh, COVID ta ta time, and she she was playing there with uh, uh, Nel uh, Nelson, and uh, she told me why I uh, won't go go uh, go with him in uh, G G Geneva, and uh, I said yes, uh, I'm <laughs> go go going, and uh, right after five months, uh, I started uh, yes studying in G G Geneva and with this amazing hu hu human being and the mu musician yes. Nelson Gurner. So she helped me a lot and also with the scholarship to be there in GG Geneva because we all know that it is so expensive <laughs> to live there. And uh, yeah, um, 
it's like that. She helped me a lot. It's wonderful that you, yeah, that you, ha you had the opportunity to connect and the opportunity to learn directly. And yes. Nelson is an amazing musician. Oh my God, yes, yeah, fantastic. And now I understand you're continuing your studies in, in Berlin. Berlin. Yes. 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 Closer yes. to Sonia now. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. But uh, uh, I have uh, always uh, uh, people uh, next to me who are helping me. So uh, it, uh, it was Marta yes. for, for a year and now it will be so, so Sonia for, I think, three years. And uh, I will go to Ber Berlin and study there. So it's amazing. <laughs> I notice that when you're touring, yes. you tour with two hats on. And I'd like to draw a little bit out about that because it's quite rare yeah. in the classical piano um, career path. You perform solo recitals as Gigor Gigashvili. Yes. Classical piano repertoire, such yes. as tonight. Yes. And then you also <laughs> have this mysterious format or um, ticket selling headline <laughs> of Gigor Gigashvili and band. Yes, yes. Tell me about this second act, this Gigor Gigashvili and yes. band. Uh, this is um, what I call, I don't know, my other me, my alter ego. <laughs> yes, uh, I am a p p pianist also in this band group with my, my friends, with my four friends. But we started with uh, me and my two friends, uh, girls who were singing and I, uh, I was playing the pia, pia, piano. And then uh, we managed to become uh, popular in, uh, in Georgia. And uh, for instance, uh, uh, our one particular video has uh, two million v -v views in Ge Ge Georgia. So, yeah, uh, it's it's really uh, really good. And then um, I proposed this uh, idea to Sonia, and she loved it. She loved it. And um, uh, we are fi uh, five people: me, two singer, um, my my very very good, my my best 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 friends, um, uh, and uh, also um, one bass play, play, player player mm -hmm. player, uh, one drummer. Uh, me um, and we have this uh, kind of program when uh, where we um, sing and do the so songs uh, of uh, uh, our own so songs um, and also Georgian covers and also international pop, hip hop, uh, rap, uh, also uh, every kind of mu mu music. So what what we like we ca ca cover <laughs> so uh, and uh, yeah uh, for instance tomorrow we will have a co concert uh, in Heidelberg um, so uh, I will start with the re recital with Schumann and all the serious mu 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 music and after my concert we will um, yeah Turn we into will <laughs> yes yeah unserious <laughs> mu 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 music but yeah uh, it's my uh, it's part of me, and uh, when I when I when I play thirty or forty classical music mm. concert, I really need to like uh, everything to 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 be um, ah, ah, out uh, be because my energy. Uh, <laughs> I, I, uh, I can't. Uh, I think yeah. it's. I think it's incredibly healthy. I think hold it in my yeah. myself. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think it's healthy, and I. I, I that, that's where I was going about what you gain from performing this other, in this other yeah. capacity, <laughs> and what it brings to you. And I think it. I think it's really healthy to, to shift and yeah. to remember and to enjoy performance. My roots. <laughs> yeah, but 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 it sounds in in a way it sounds you know. In essence, it's chamber music, but just yes, different yes, repertoire and yes, different, yes. different. And modality. it helps. Uh, it helps uh, also classical ch ch chamber mu 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 music. Yeah. Uh, this um, and each other. Yes, it helps each other, and um, um, also it helps uh, how to present myself on the stage. Yes. So uh, I think uh, that's the. That, uh, that's why I've got the audience prize all, almost every <laughs> competition. 
And, I don't know. And <laughs> do you find, uh, do, you, do you have the same audience? Or do you have um, a different audience that follow you in your classical oh, performances to your... Oh, uh, interesting question. Your uh, and band yeah. audience? Are, uh, they, are they different? Sometimes uh, I am so happy uh, when when the young, like me, uh, yeah. JJ generation uh, listens to uh, our group's uh, band's uh, concerts and then uh, goes to my classical music concert because it means yeah. a lot to, to me uh, because there are not so many young uh, listeners of classical music mm, these days. And uh, I also contribute s something to classical music and uh, I think I help uh, in some way <laughs> uh, classical mu 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 music to become um, to bridge, to, to become relevant. a bit more accessible, yes. a bit yes. more accessible. Yes, to help to help people find a way in. Yes, yes, and that's really, really, really helpful for 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 me, or also to have this uh, young uh, uh, people's energy in the uh, in the hall. Um, and yes, it means a lot. And and <laughs> they, do you use the same venue, or are you are you? Performing. Uh, sometimes it's the same ve venue, but for the band we need uh, also um, some kind of other uh, things uh, which cannot be possible, like in this hall. Of course. So, um, <coughs> so sometimes it's not possible, but it's more interesting when it's the same venue. I think for, so. Uh, I, th me. I think it yeah. would be very interesting yes, yes, to see yes. the same space resonate slightly differently. Yes. <laughs> um, well, I, I would very much, if I can find a time, I, I would love to hear the band in Please. performance. <laughs> um, but we'll return to, to tonight's program, yes. which is who you are and why you've just done so well at the yeah. Rubenstein competition. Yes. It's a very in my sense, um, an almost, uh, it's a very classic yes. piano repertoire yeah. uh, program for this evening. You've selected Scarlatti, Brahms and Schumann. Yes. And it's full of virtuosity and, and, and very pianistic and yes. very, very <laughs> um, traditional. How do you, well, why did you choose, yeah. what, what, what what was the, what's the artistic <laughs> vision or message that we, we, we should take yeah, from tonight's um, programming? It's interesting because uh, uh, in my head uh, it sounds like uh, it's a love letter. Uh, because uh, from the age of 20 uh, till today, uh, I feel very melodramatic. <laughs> and yes, because uh, uh, it's the age of um, starting to feel uh, uh, every kind of feeling, like to, mm -hmm. um, to, uh, it's like uh, exams uh, of feelings, yes, and uh, um, uh, I really uh, fa find my, uh, my, uh, myself uh, in Brahms and in Schumann making, uh, make, making love, but, but in the purest way, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, uh, yeah, uh, I all my my program always uh, resonates uh, what what I feel, uh, and um, yeah, uh, I I was completely free to uh, make the program decision, and it's the it's more the most important for the artist to play play whatever he wants. So uh, yeah, it's ca kind of love letter to the audience and al also to myself, self, and also to to my loved one. So yeah, beautiful. I think <laughs> I, 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 it works. Now. I, I think it, I think it works, and I look forward to the combination um, with all the the background knowledge that that I have about you as a as a broad artist. Yeah. I'm really looking <laughs> forward to honing in on this this particular aspect of you, yeah, uh, uh, you. tonight here in Aubonne. Mm -hmm. And I think it, you've touched on something very important, which is that um, the Ambassador Programme and, and Classic believes in, in, in you performing what you want to perform. Oh, yes. And supporting yes. artists as they are. Yes. And, and, and 
I think that's important with the best competitions. You play what you want to play and you yes. show who you are yes. to, to an audience. And then from there, doors open. I yeah. think that's the, how this industry works. But yes. um, thank you, Georgi. It's a real pleasure to, 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 to meet you in person. Um, I do recommend to everybody out there to do some research into his <laughs> other music. Uh, but it's it's wonderful to meet you and, and congratulations thank on being so part much. of the Classic Ambassador program. No, thank you. Thank you for for these uh, amazing questions, B, because it's so boring to answer <laughs> all the classical, classic qua qua questions. So thank you so much. Well, we want to know <laughs> we want to know who you are. So thank you for sharing who you are, and uh, we'll hear who you are tonight. Probably yes. <laughs> Great. Thanks very much. Thank you.